Hey guys, welcome back to some Mass Effect Andromeda. I just want to uh, apologize because there will not be any commentary uh, for this episode. I'm actually coming in um, after this is recorded. It's because while I was recording, like the uh, previous video, there was a glitch in my um, audio recording. And I don't know why, so I'm guessing I'm just going to have to get a new recording software. I've been using Audacity, and it worked for the first hour, but every video I've made since then of recording this game has not worked. It it just, the first few minutes worked, and then it just it started cutting out, and it was lagging, and it was just, it was not usable at all. So, unfortunately, these next few parts are not going to have any commentary, and I'm sorry about that. Um, I'm about to uh, get this batch edited, and, um, and get it going and stuff, and uh, I hope you guys still enjoy the gameplay. Um, hopefully by the next time I start recording I will have this all figured out and we can get back to uh, normal commentary gameplay. So, um, alright, so without, without, uh, with that being said, uh, y'all enjoy the gameplay, uh, hit like, subscribe, there will be more coming either way, commentary or not, I'm still going to be recording this game every time I play it, so uh, yep, y'all have a good one. Captain wants to see a full duty roster. I just updated the charts. You'll want to see crew reassignments first. Okay, folks. This is what we've been waiting for. Let your teams know that docking procedures are now in It'll be nice to see some friendly faces this time. The Nexus runs a support crew, just enough to finish building the station and provide safe harbor for the Arcs. Means we can start waking our people up. They built a bar, right? Gotta have champagne for the welcome party. You're expecting one? After what we've been through, I could use a buzz. We all could. Yeah. Rough ride so far. We'll bounce back. Real food and a shower are just ahead. Here we are. Uh, I don't see any champagne. Where is everybody? Well, this can't be right. Welcome to the Nexus, gateway to Andromeda. I'm Avina, a virtual intelligence designed to assist you with immigration. Uh, can you tell us where the welcome party is hiding? I'm sorry, my code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. Please select from the following pre-programmed responses. What year is it? The current year is 2819. After spending over 600 years in stasis, it's normal to feel disoriented or confused upon arrival. Our helpful medical staff can assist with any physical or psychological after effects you may be experiencing. Well, she's got the date right, at least. So where is everyone? What can you tell me about the Andromeda Galaxy? Here in Andromeda, you are over two million light years away from the Milky Way Galaxy. This is the furthest any life form has ever traveled outside our home system, making you a brave pioneer indeed. The Nexus itself is located in a region known as the Helios Cluster. Here, you and thousands of your fellow colonists will fulfill your dreams of settling a new home. Fortune awaits. What is the Nexus? The Nexus serves as the central hub for the Andromeda Initiative's colonization efforts. It is the first destination for all colonists upon their arrival in the new galaxy. 
Please enjoy the many venues the Nexus has to offer. As the station expands, it will one day serve as the seat of government for Milky Way colonists. Providing a safe, stable, and prosperous environment is our primary goal. Not from the looks of it. That's all. It has been my pleasure. Please see one of our helpful immigration staff for further assistance. And welcome to your new home in Andromeda, where the brightest star is you. Current wait time for immigration processing is... Unknown error. Right. That was helpful. Plants are still alive. It's like they didn't finish building it. Hello? This place should be packed with people. Hi there. We're from Arc Hyperion, and wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Did you say an Arc? Yeah, we just got in. And for what it's worth, your VI over there could use an update. But we thought you were all dead. What? Or captured, or lost in dark space, or... But you're here. You have no idea how much this means. I don't believe it. I'm Tyrion Kandros. I lead our militia on the Nexus. I'm Ryder. This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. But aren't you expecting us? You're the first arc we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. Everything that could go wrong with our plan has. We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. We're familiar with it. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we called them. Are things back to normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. No word from the other Pathfinders? No word from anyone, period. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're in no sh- We're here. You guys go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command structure has been fractured. Some of us are filling in for leaders who died. Is it true? They said being a report for duty. And no one was expecting an arc to finally show up. Docking procedures are green across the board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. The crew of the Hyperion. Good luck. I'm Jaren Tan, director of the initiative. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. We've heard about what happened, and we're ready to help. We could use any supplies you have. Food, water, we're short on everything. This is Foster Addison. She oversees colonial affairs. Where's the Pathfinder? You're looking at him. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's dead. 
He made me his successor. Alec is dead. Please understand, the entire initiative is at risk. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust, and there's been no word from the other Arcs. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. We need to find more resources. But that takes people, and we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A golden world. Now more than ever, we need a Pathfinder. It now falls to you, Ryder. Are you up to the task? I may not have been the first choice, but I'm ready for this. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. That's no way to treat a guest. I'm Nak Morkesh, superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, but now isn't the time for on-the-job training. At least the Pathfinder here seems willing to try. We could use a fresh perspective. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. We're all feeling the pressure. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. I'm happy to work out the details with your associate. Welcome to the Nexus. Thank you for standing up for me there. Mm, hopes in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance Ma'am, to... the Hyperion's core is now online. Let me show you something. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. And when the power runs out? You'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. And don't be shy. Come see me when you have a chance. What happened? To who? To whom? And your goddamn father. Sorry, my face is tired from dealing with everything. And right now, I just want to know what happened with Alec. Not how he died. I pulled those logs. What happened with Pathfinder? In the moment, it saved my life. But it seems my father meant for me to get the role eventually. It isn't hereditary. If we wanted an inbred monarchy, we could have left half our gene stock back home. <sighs> Not home. The Milky Way. This is home. This mess. We don't have a lot of options, Ryder. Maybe you'll prove your father right. After 14 months of failed colonization, forgive me if I don't hold my breath. You've had no colony successes in over a year. How many tries is that? Less than you'd think. The Scourge, Spoiled Worlds, Exiles, Hostiles. 
We can't just plop down an outpost and expect picket fences. We need the Pathfinder and Sam to scout, evaluate, and inspire. The Initiative promised a goal. Andromeda has not cooperated. And if it had? Beautiful, utopian horseshit. Colonies that produce and support each other. The Nexus as Citadel, not headed by Tan, or even me. There must be some kind of plan for encountering hostile aliens. We can't have been that naive. We expected life. Not an enemy that refuses to talk. They don't attack. They disinfect. We're nothing until we're bacteria. Sorry, 14 months and you stoop to poetry. That's how bad it is. Not sure who started it, but we're calling them Ket. Kandros will know more. Maybe too much. You don't trust him? I trust him to defend us. I do not trust a rising military influence in a supposedly civilian initiative. We came here to make history, Ryder. Not repeat it. Ugh, oh, goddamn poetry. Excuse me, Director Addison. Ryder? It's Pathfinder. Ryder, we're starving here. If we don't get a foundation of outposts to feed the initiative, we might as well be 600 years dead. Alec promised a lot. None of it panned out. That's what you're up against. Why people won't trust you. Why I don't trust you. Prove me wrong. I know that look. The others bent your ear, did they? Something like that? You get used to it. Just focus on being a Pathfinder. Can't argue with results, though they'll try. Anyway, welcome to Militia HQ. Excuse the mess. This office fields militia work, Nexus security, and looking for the Turian Ark. What's the word on the Turian Ark? Scattered readings. Some indicate the Natanus was destroyed, others that people are alive. Who knows? If you need anything, come see me, even if it's just a vent. It's rough out there. I might need backup, if you can spare the people. I have strike teams specializing in assault and extraction. If you need serious firepower, my Apex teams have you covered. In fact, I could give you authority to dispatch them. It'll cut down their response time. Thank you. Our current ops are on the terminal. See if there's anything that could use a shot where it counts. What do you know about the enemies we've encountered? The Ket? We usually see them on worlds with those alien structures. The Ket don't take kindly to anyone studying them. Not sure why. They don't talk to us. Every time we cross paths, there's a fight or they take prisoners. Why? What do they want? No one knows. But I've seen their weaponry and what they do to those prisoners. I want them a long, long way from the Nexus. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. <laughs>